Hey guys, my name is Angela and welcome to our channel. Well, today I am on site at our Tennessee property and since we're starting to get a little more comfortable out here, it's time for something a little more comfortable. Outside we don't have much except for like some folding chairs and folding tables, but I want something more, something that we can enjoy. So we got a hold of two Adirondack chairs and a table that will go along great with our new firing. Let's go put these together and see what they look like. I'm to help you. You can put these in the trash. Well, there's the first one put together. I did kind of get two of the bolt screws kind of mixed up and had to swap them back, but it was easy. This was a very simple put together. They actually give you all the tools. I had brought some just in case I needed like a screwdriver or something, but all it takes is an Allen wrench and that they give you. So I would say A plus, four stars, five stars, however many stars it is you give. That was really easy for putting together. I'm going to go ahead and put together the table that goes in between kind of the two chairs whenever you have them set up. We'll see how easy that one goes. I don't have any question that it won't be easy. And then we'll put together the other chair so we can try it all out together. There's a crazy one Yeah, yeah, Pull it off. <laughs> and so now we are going to cut. You want to cut? Ah, I got a baby scissors. Where I've got to be careful. Instructions are on top this time. Okay. That is a very nice, sturdy table. It'll be very nice to use. This side has one or two. Isaac is helping me cut the tape. Oh, bottom. So I counted, it only takes 12 bolts for each of the chairs. And now that I know the order in which it goes and that type thing, it should go a lot quicker and I know what I can put to the side so it doesn't get in my way.
I'm putting it in backwards right here to see. Yeah, I see it goes through fine. Now that's smart. You're chasing the threads. You're basically using your bolt as a cap. Of course I am. Totally meant that. So does it go through the correct way now? Let's try. Yeah. Yeah, it feels like it. Sweet. There you go. What do you need me for? Help. For Bob White. I can't be Vanna White, but I'll be Bob White. Bob White? Hey. Shoo, you're making it dirty. I know. I, no, hey, you, you asked for my help. <laughs> yeah, can I do that one? It's a really long bolt. I didn't do this one. Okay. All right, let me go get over here and get it, okay? Thank you. Well, as you can see, we have the chairs set up at our fire pit out on our property, and I am very pleased with them. They seem to be very good construction. I have to say the assembly was very easy. I think I said there were 12 bolts per chair and then 12 bolts for the table. So, I mean, it was very simple to put together. They seem very strong, and I think they'll last a long time out here. And I have to say they're very comfortable too. It gives you a nice sturdy support. All we've kind of had up until now were folding chairs or like the regular kind of hammock style camping chair. And these are, feel so much better. These are made of a composite wood, which is I guess more like a plastic. So they won't rot or be damaged in the same way as wood would be. So I expect these will last a very long time out in the elements, but it is in the elements. So I guess time will tell. The only issue I did have with assembly is one of the inserts, which is kind of like a little nut for the bolt to go into. It kind of stripped out as I was screwing it in. We were able to fix it with extra tools, but it was something to think about overall. It is nice to have a set for me and Sam to be able to sit by the fire. And this is a nice sturdy table. It's bigger than we were figuring it would be, but there is more than enough room for probably two plates and two drinks. These do have some heft to them, which I consider to be a good thing because if it has heft to it, it's worth something. So these will last very well, I believe. Talking about features, there's not a whole lot except there is a little drink holder on both of the chairs that kind of pulls out and then it just very easily goes back underneath to be hidden so it won't get knocked off or broken or anything like that. Well guys, thanks for coming along as I put these new Adirondack chairs and table together. Um, if you are interested in them, there is a link below. You can check it out and see what they're all about. Check out the different colors and options, that type thing. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them below. And otherwise, we'll see you guys next time on one of the homesteads. Bye.